Hi, my name is Bob. This is Ubuntu Basics. This is a video that shows a little bit about how to do some things with swapping keys around in Ubuntu. I have some prior videos and in this video I'm going to show how you can swap around the mouse keys. I'm also going to show a trick in how to cut, copy, and paste. This is a trick that is not available in Microsoft Windows. I have got up here a text file and I'm going to zoom in on it and there's a sentence here that says this is a test. Before you can cut or copy you've got to select text and there's various ways you can do this. In Ubuntu one way you can do it is put your cursor in the middle of a word and tap it and that selects the word. Having selected the word, then you can control C or control X, and then go somewhere else and control V and it pastes. If you want to get the whole line, just go somewhere in the middle of the line and triple tap. That gets the whole works. Now I have selected it, right? So if I hit control V, nothing would happen, right? Well, let me open up another text file right next door and here I am in it and I want to show you a trick. If you go to your trackpad or your mouse and hit button 2 you get a paste. You get a paste from a selection without the intervening control C or control V. I've got a laptop and so I don't have a mouse I've got a trackpad and the way you do that is to simultaneously press both track pad buttons. The one on the left is 1, the one on the right is 3, and the way you get 2 is to press 1 and 3 simultaneously. There's another way you can select text, of course. You can go to the beginning of the line, hold down your shift key, and then down arrow. Let me unzoom and go to the panel and I want to show you a trick. In prior video, way over on the right, if you click the icon and go to system settings and then go to assistive, assistive technologies, you can change some things around. Or, instead of doing all of that, you can go to the center of your panel, right-click, Add to Panel, go down till you see the icon of the wheelchair, Add to Panel, and there it is. You can see the little wheelchair up there. If you tap on that, and then go to mouse keys and then click right here where it says pointer can be controlled using the keypad. Watch what happens to the icon up in the panel. It turns into a mouse. Now there are three buttons on this icon of the mouse. If you hit the left one it turns black. If you hit the right one, it turns black. If you hold down first left, then right, well you get both of them, but you didn't hit them simultaneously. If you hit them simultaneously, then you get two. In a prior video, I showed how you could reassign the left mouse click that's button 1, to the 10 key. In fact, you could reassign it to the 5 in the center of the 10 key. In this video, I'm going to show how you can reassign the mouse keys so that if you want to, you could assign the 5 in the center of the 10 key as the number 2 mouse click the one in 
the middle that you don't have, the one that you would achieve by simultaneously pressing the left and right mouse buttons. It's very complicated sounding. I'm going to go over here to my scripts files and I'm going to show you some stuff. These are two files. I just put them in to remind myself because Linux is so complicated. If you go to a terminal and type in x input and then get dash button dash map, it will show you your mouse key settings. If you want to rearrange the order of these things, then you just change one letter. You change get to set. Well, let me open this one up. Display. X input get dash button dash map and my device is 4. I'm going to close that. Let's close them all. I'm going to unzoom and open up a terminal control alt T and X in put space get dash button dash map 4 and no surprise there my mouse butt buttons are assigned 1 is 1, 2 is 2, 3 is 3, 4 is 4 and so on. Now if I were going to do so I could rearrange these things and I'm changing get to set and let's go to the end here and type 2, 1, 3, 4 and when I hit enter guess what? Now when I type get they've been rearranged. Well what does this mean? Well it means that if I go to my 10 key and I hit the 5 button I got the center mouse key. Can you see that up there? That's key number 2 in the middle of the 10 key on the keyboard. <coughs> you can of course reassign that and I've showed how to do that in a prior video. I hope this was helpful and I hope you enjoyed this. My name is Pop. I have a whole bunch of videos on YouTube basics and I thank you very much.